Right, hello. We'll get to another fear video and today. Unfortunately, I can't, I, I didn't really lie, but what's going on this weekend, it's not really um true what I said. So basically, I'll be announcing things next week because after next week, it could be happening anything. Could be happening, things will be changing. So I'll be announcing it more next week. Because I've only got one more week yet before anything changes. And I, unfortunately, I will not be uploading an exploring video this week because I've had, I've had a busy week. I've been meeting up with people. I've been, you know, doing things and not had a chance this week. I went to rest and then the bus weren't available. So, you know, what can you do? But anyway, just go back to this video. And it's, it's again, something new again. But I let you see the picture and you think like, okay, why am I talking about that? But I'll discuss it. When I show you the picture, so yeah, I'm talking about the series called Hourglass, and basically, it's about four or five seasons, isn't there? And I just want to say how good the series was, and soon I'll be doing something with that, talking about that again with something else, probably in a few weeks' time. Not yet, yet. I'm just not sure yet because things are just it could be different days I'm uploading, but. Yeah, literally, um, about our girl and how good it was. And because you had Lacey Turner, didn't you, for one season, and what was good. And then you had Michelle Keegan for four or three seasons. Cause it ended in 2020, didn't it? For some reason, they never continued it. And I think they could have done. And it is a good series. It is a really good series, to be fair. It's got a lot of people we know in it. A lot of people. A lot of soap actors. One of these Denzel and Corey, so... They ain't done bad there, have they? Yeah, she, she's from Cora, isn't she, Michelle Keegan? And I think the guy who played Fingers as well, he was from Coronation Street. Well, Lacey's from EastEnders, isn't she? He played, um, um, yeah. And someone else, Lee Carter from EastEnders, was in it. Cindy Junior, who's going to be in it very soon in EastEnders. I'll be doing about things about soaps very soon as well. I just don't know when to fill it in. Yeah, Cindy Junior's in it as well. There's a lot of people in it. The girl from Atley Bridge. There are a lot of people, a lot of people in the show. And it's based on terrorism, isn't it, really? It's based on the truth. It's based on truth, true facts, really. But basically, that the war side of what goes on, isn't it? In, when they're fighting and stuff. Because it started off with Taliban, didn't it? With, um... Lacey Turner, if I'm right, it was Taliban, and then it was El Shabab, wasn't it, in the second series, based in, yeah, the, yeah in Kenya, if I'm right, then, then, then the third and the fourth series, I think, it's, I think, no, the second and the third series were a bit confusing, because they did two parters, didn't they, they did two, two things in one thing, you had, you had like a, like a little terrorist group, and then you had something else, but, only for two groups on of it was Taliban and Al Shabab, or they called. I think Taliban was in the one with Stacey in it, and the, the other ones I'm just confused about. Some of them were just, um, yeah, very strange. The last one was I like, was terrorist as well. I don't, yeah, the last series was terrorism as well. It was all linked, wasn't it, to, to, to the Taliban, yeah. I can't, can't remember what that group was called. It was ISIL or something, wasn't it? But yeah, it was all based on that and it was just really good and stuff. What I do is disgusting, isn't it? But, you know. <coughs> but yeah. I, I, I just... Yeah, I can't remember what the others were. One of them wasn't to do with... With, jihad, with jihadists and that one of them was to do with something else wasn't it that was just people in they went to, 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 to Tunisia didn't they or somewhere there were criminals there but I don't know what that was all about nothing to do with what they really fight against really is it yeah yeah they, yeah and then you know terrorism and shit in the second my favourite series was probably number two probably I think number two and probably Number one, the Stacey's one as well. They did like terrorist attacks and shit in it, didn't they? And crazy, and it just shows what they're like when they when they do it. 
in real life, and it? it's just based on. I think it's, I, th I think they're good actors. They're brilliant, and it's just because they yeah. And I'm not sure if the, the the lad from Wolverhampton it was from Walter Road because he does look familiar. I think it was from Walter Road one of them. Yeah, the Wolverhampton bloke. I'm sure he was from um, well, um, the Wolves. Obviously, he's from Wolves. From if he's from Wolverhampton, um, was in um, yeah. The, the kid we kept playing up all the time. But I don't think Fingers is from Manchester. Michelle Keegan's from Manchester, isn't she? They're from Manchester, them two. Fingers, I think his name was, yeah. He sadly passed in the fifth series, didn't he? Or the fourth series. Fourth series, or fifth series, I think it was, yeah. I'm on that episode now, I'm watching a murder again. I like to watch these things over again sometimes. Absolute, like... <laughs> I wonder if they could carry it on. Because apparently, um, Lauren from EastEnders... Was meant to be the new Lacey and Michelle Keegan kind of Mo Molly, wasn't it? And Georgia, wasn't it? They played, and I don't know Lauren, Lauren were playing it, but also she stepped down and she's in East Enders at the minute. Stopped four years ago, didn't it? It stopped in twenty twenty, so it's not been on since. So yeah, it should, it should come back. I think it should come back. It was a really good series. There's a few things it could cross over with, and I'll talk about that in, 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 in at another time, after when I've spoken about the other thing. So yeah, that was the video for today, really. And I think I think you get more of these videos of me going out, so be aware. And yeah, because obviously things will be changing. As I said, I will be making a, an announcement video next week for it. So. Keep an eye. You will get vlog videos as well. I've been missing the vlogs, don't worry. I'm, I'm feeling it as well. I've missed my vlog videos, to be fair, because <laughs> none of the chance to go anywhere at the minute. To do vlog videos, vlog videos only once a month for one educate, not once a time, really. I don't get the time just to go out everywhere all the time. That's why I, I, I hope I start driving soon. I don't know if I'm going to start my driving tests, but I hope I don't think I can because my because of the, the disability I've got. But I'm sure because of my eyes and stuff, I don't know if I can or not. Because I don't want to tell you what my disability is because I don't think you do. You don't need to. I think you can kind of tell if I said my eyes. I don't need to. I don't want people to know <laughs> what that disability is. It, you know what I mean? It's kind of private. But I don't think I can. I don't think I can, I hope I can, because it'd be so much easier, because I can just drive to places, I won't drive all the time, but at least, at least I can just, if I want to go somewhere, I can go somewhere, do you know what I mean? To fuck around with buses and shit, man, don't you? And trains, to be fair, trains are probably easier. But yeah, maybe I could do a video about me getting a car or something, I don't know. Well, you got a lot. You got you got a few vlogs this year. You got another football vlog coming up soon in April. If I can still go, <laughs> hopefully, I will not be happy if I couldn't go because that's a game I wanted to see as well. To be fair, it could be another two. Could be two football vlogs. Another one in another one near where I live, and then there's another one going on in the end of the year. So you got a few vlogs coming up. It's not like I'm not filming any vlogs this year. But I just wish I could do more. But anyway, I hope you enjoyed this video and I'll see you tomorrow in another probably one of these videos. Peace.